All right, this uh, video is about multi-tap transformers. These ones uh, would normally be carried in the service truck. This allows you to replace 120 volt, 208, and 240 volt transformers that step down to uh, 24 volts as the secondary voltage. This here is the secondary voltage, okay? Uh, green denotes common, red denotes hot. And on this side, if you were to wire it into a 120 volt furnace, white would be the common, all right? And then it says black would be the hot 120 volt. All right, if you were to use this on a 208 system, uh, then you would use the white and the red wire, all right? If you were gonna wire this into, say, a fan coil or air handler, it would be 240 volts, and you could use the white and the orange, all right? And then it's very important to make sure that these are wire nutted off or, or uh, somehow uh, make, make sure that these do not touch any ground or uh, the other wires as well. You also cannot say this was, you were going to use this for a 240 volt system. You would use these two wires right here. All right. Make sure you do not wire nut these together. Okay. Make sure they're wire nutted separately. All right. Um, you want to make sure that you uh, protect this transformer right here. This would be protected with maybe a 3 amp fuse. All right. Um, and it becomes very important when you start trying to power uh, some other 24 volt devices off of this system. This 40 VA, all right, it's, it's actually equal to watts, all right, so 40 watts. Watts equals volts times amps. That's why it actually says 40 VA, volts times amps, all right. Um, that has to do with the 24 volt side, all right. So if you said that 40 uh, 40 VA divided by 24, that would actually equal 1.66 amps that you could run through the secondary side, which would be the top side right here, okay? Primaries down low, secondaries up top on this one. If you can actually see uh, that this is wider than this one right here. If you were talking about the 120 volt coil that's in here, uh, you would have five times more wraps than the 24 volt coil. And that's how it induces, all right, the, uh, the AC voltage and reduces it to, down from 120 volts to 24 volts. All right, so that's it. Hope you enjoyed yourself, and see you next time at acservicetech.com.